Okay, so, like, I guess this video is the video, it's gonna be the video that you watch, like, when you first come to the channel and stuff, so I'm just gonna go cover some things. One, um, my bed doesn't have a sheet on it because I'm doing laundry, and it's, like, 7 o'clock on a Saturday. Two, um, really what this is, is just, uh, I fell in love with the whole tag team edition of the Pokemon cards, Now I don't know how to play the game, and I'm not, like searching for cards to uh like to sell i just for some reason really want to complete this whole entire run of pokemon cards so i've been buying them and then eventually after i got a lot i bought a book as you can see it's this binder that has like the the pages like already in it and uh i just decided hey i'm gonna go through and uh try to get all the cards in the set uh tax season's coming well it is tax season my tax return's coming so i'm gonna get my it's gonna be the first time i buy one of those booster boxes those uh boxes with all the booster packs in it they're like a hundred dollars or something so hopefully i can get a lot of cars from that um so this video i'm just gonna it's just showing you what i've gotten so far um my real love for pokemon as you can tell probably by the theme of the channel is uh, i love snorlax um when I was younger, I started buying Pokemon cards first edition. It's hard to prove because I don't have them, but I definitely had like some first edition good pulls like first edition Charizard, um, Dragonite, Gyarados, and the only first edition card I have left because I took all my cards to my neighbor's house to trade. My mom yelled at me. And I left the whole binder there. Uh, but the only one I have left is um, Snorlax. Also... I think my cousin might have stolen some. No proof on that, though. So anyway, with this video, I just want to go through and show you uh, what I've gotten so far. And uh, two, like, the main goal for this is to complete the whole entire run. But the, like, minor goal is to get, like, all the, like, holographic versions of all the cards. Like, all the commons, all the rares, and all that stuff. And I got one card that's, like, $22 if I want to sell it. But my plan... I'm not buying them to sell it. I said I just want to have this, and then if like the next one that comes out is interesting, then I'll do that one. But I don't know if I'm gonna. I don't. I don't plan on buying like every set. I don't plan on going back and buying past sets because they just never like interested me. So uh, yeah, this channel is definitely going to be about uh, me opening cards and stuff like that. But I never like to shoehorn myself into like one genre. So like when the new games come out, I might get back into like amateur professional striving for like a amateur professional thing and like then go over like pokemon builds and stuff like that but that's in the future i don't know no promises so uh let's just look at these and i'm going to show off a little bit nothing impressive but i just want to show you what i have so far so oh my god the glare i'm on professional but yeah as you can see i'm missing some but like as you can tell i get, definitely got some of the shinies like that's probably my favorite one so far um Let's really pull out like this. Get out of this glare. Sorry about that, people. Actually, glare helps because you can see which ones are like shiny and which ones aren't. Um, I know some are gonna be like, "That's like the worst way to keep your cards." Like I said, they're for me. They're not for like resell or anything like that. But uh, and I was I, I bought a, a star deck which gave me a list, and I was like, "Oh, I got all these blank spaces to fill." And apparently, all these blank spaces are like. The super rare ones besides like Almastar. But uh hopefully we'll get that one eventually. But what stuff I'm really proud about is that Twinatar is my favorite pseudo legendary. And I have his whole entire run. Well we're st well Twinatar with all like the shiny ones, whether they're hollow or reverse hollow. I don't think there's much of a difference. Uh the first one I got buying these cards was this guy, and I thought it was worth something, but it wasn't. And Lycanroc. I got these two uh I believe in the same pack. And then, you know, Pharisee's great. Um, Executor. And then I also got, I don't have the whole uh, Dragonite run. I still need to get Shiny one of this, but I have, and Dragonair, but I got Shiny Dragonite, which, you know. And this is probably my favorite card, the Eevee Snorlax. And then I realized there's two other versions of that that I don't have that are, like, super rare. So I might buy the Rainbow version because I saw it's only, like, $20. And that's if I, like, absolutely can't pull it at all, then I'll go there. But I almost have the whole Pidgey run 
um, reverse hollow, so that's pretty exciting. And then you get into here, and then these are just like more like basic ones. And then, um, and then this one here isn't, it's just like a, like the GX one. I thought I had the rainbow one, but I don't. And then you got this full art one here. And this is the one that I have that's like, this is like my, my best one. And so far that's it. All these are the blank. The one I'm going to put in here, I might like, I don't know fill this up with like the next run but so far yeah this is my goal and eventually i'd like to maybe get some picture frames to start getting some of those uh those giant cards that are super pointless and useless but like you know that's what i'm after um also i don't know if you can tell or not but i'm no professional uh i'm not really striving to give you movie quality i believe in high quality low quality which that means that it's a low quality video low quality video but it has a lot of heart, a lot of passion. I hope you enjoy this. I mean, you don't have to if you don't want to. But regardless, I hope you have a wonderful night.